Welcome, everybody. Thanks for joining us for NBA action on 2K Sports. Alongside Grant Hill and Steve Smith, Allie LaForce, our reporter, I'm Brian Anderson. Hey, Allie. Hey, Brian. Well, Damian Lillard talked about his clutch gene. He said, quote, I never think there's a game that I can't take control of. When I'm out there, I feel how hard the defense is trying to stop me, regardless of how I'm shooting the ball. I want to show them why they should be worried and why they should be on edge. Brian? Yeah, like always a threat. Thanks for that. All right, let's check out the starting lineup for the Trailblazers. Lillard and Simons are the one and the two. Grant and Nurkic, they're inside at the four and the five. And it's Thibel in at the three, the small forward. And for Orlando, Wagner and Boncaro at the forward slots. Gary Harris out there with Markel Fultz. And it's Carter in at the center position. And these are two teams each looking to turn things around. It's been a cold stretch for both of them lately, Smitty. They both have been struggling, B.A., and when you're facing a team that's also struggling, you look at a game like this as a chance to snap out of it. If you lose it, it's even bigger drain on your confidence. Here's Dan Carroll. Pass to Harris. Clock at six. And here's Wagner. Shoots over Thibel. Simons with a rebound. Outside Thibel. Here's Lillard. Fires for three. It's rebounded by Ben Carroll. Fultz against Lillard. Outside Fultz. it from 20. The shot no good. And the Trailblazers go on the other way now. Well, I know you spent a lot of your career in Orlando. What are your favorite memories of that time? None, B.A. You know I was hurt the entire time while I was in Orlando. No, but in all seriousness, they were great people, great city, and it was fun to see young guys like Jameer Nelson and Dwight Howard get drafted and emerge as great players and leaders for their ball club. Here's Fultz. After the basket by Portland. A little over a minute and a half into this first quarter. Here's Bancaro. That shot is off. Hey, great D that time from Grant. Pass to Lillard. Grant, right side. Simons, outside. The three ball. And Fultz pulls it down. The Magic have gone 0 for 3 from the floor to begin this one. Got it. Good job in the low post. Some guys just understand how to generate points. He's one of them. Fantastic replay we just saw of the mobile one drive. You're toasting the defense and getting in close. They'll take possessions like that one all day. Carter against Nurkic. Grant the pass to Lillard. Count it. A jack of all trades, Jeremy Grant also has a strong feel for when his guys are uncovered. The Magic have gone one of four to begin this one. Fultz against Lillard. With the teardrop. Portland grabs the miss. And you talk about a basketball family. Jeremy Grant's father was a pro. His uncle, his brothers. I mean, plenty of competition growing up. Now here's Lillard. Grant the screen. Six to shoot. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. And Fultz pulls it down. Orlando trailing here. Pass to Ben Carroll. Harris outside. Carter, a screen on Simons. And here's Harris outside. Here's Carter. And it's slammed in by Carter. Right there, Carter using his instincts and motor to track down the miss and convert into second chance points. Lillard outside. Now here's Nurkic. Shot from 12. Simons outside. For three, here's Lillard. Lillard can't get that one to fall. 
Here's Ben Carroll. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. Carter, a screen on Grant. It's all tied in Orlando. And we'll get things started in the second quarter when we return. We hope you're enjoying the game. Both teams tonight keeping things pretty even on the scoreboard so far. And for the Magic guys, what jumps out to you stat-wise? Well, a big differentiator was their ability to generate offense by pounding the glass. And you know this, most of the time, offensive rebounds generate high percentage looks. And here are the Trailblazers now. After nine seasons together in Portland, the backcourt duo of Damian Lillard and C.J. McCollum are no longer teammates. C.J. sent to New Orleans. Taking a look at the Trailblazers. We've got Drew Eubanks. And Freddie Simons out there with Sharp. Then there's Cam Reddish. And it's Little in at the power forward position. And Orlando has possession. The Blazers making their last shot. Pass to Suggs. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. Boy, that lillard McCollum combination, Smitty. You think it was time to break him up? You know, I think both were getting a little older. Defensively, their size were a bit of an issue. But I love this scoring duo. They were incredible, B.A. Some great memories in Rip City for Dame and C.J. First one falls for him. And any time a player is asked about pressure, they'll say, I don't feel it. Smitty, I don't believe him. No, you shouldn't be, A. I think what they're doing is, obviously, you don't want to show weakness. And it's about different players, how they manage it. And I think some players do a better job than others. Good on both. And this summer, the Magic raised some eyebrows. Widely expected to take Jabari Smith with the number one overall pick. Right up until their selection, Paolo Bancaro was announced. Rival teams impressed at how well they kept their secret. Good job, Orlando. Here's Eubanks. Over Suggs. And no good trying to use the glass. Starting the second quarter, about a minute gone. No luck on that one. And here's Simons. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. The three is up. After missing his first attempt, now one for two. Oh, and that's a nice find by one of the youngest players in the league. Sharp with tremendous upside to his game. And just about a minute and a half has passed here in the second quarter. Good work there as it goes. And he gives up some size inside, but makes a great adjustment on the finish. And that takes skill and the ability to make adjustments as you're going up. Oh, save that for the dunk contest. That flush was so extra. Whether or not this game is close, he's the same guy. Focused on finishing firm at the rim. Simons has gone two for three from the field. And here in the second, two minutes gone by. Here's Suggs. And he can't get that one. Now the Trailblazers will take it the other way. Simons outside. For three. It's rebounded by Wagner. Uncontested look. Can't fault the shot selection. He's money from there. Here's Anthony. It's hauled in by the Trailblazers. And he might not be the biggest guy on the court, but Cole Anthony is explosive, Greg. He is. I mean, he surprises you with how much lift he gets. Fearless when he's going at the rim. He's caught a number of defenders off guard with that first. Here's Suggs. Pass to Anthony. This one for three. Doesn't go that time. 
The Trailblazers have got three of six shots to go here in the second quarter. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with Allie LaForce. Well, guys, it's a new day in Orlando. Magic head coach Jamal Mosley continues to lay the foundation for the team they want to be. A, quote, tough-talking, tied-together defensive team that plays offensively with pace, space, and the pass. Brian, say that five times fast. Yeah, well done, Allie. Thank you. Uh, it'll be fun to watch them build. Now a timeout called by Orlando. A line change here for Orlando. A big group substitution here for Portland. Nurkic is checked in for Eubanks. Watford comes in for Little. Jeremy Grant, he's checked in for Sharp. And Damian Lillard subbed in for Simons. One oh two left in the first half. Lillard against Fultz. Pass to Ben Carroll. Let's it go from deep. It's rebounded by Grant. Portland leading. Lillard outside. Nurkic is screen on Fultz. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. It's rebounded by Ben Carroll. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. He just missed it. Wagner against Grant. And it's Wagner off the drive. Pass to Ben Carroll. Shot and game clock separated by five. Picked by Carter. Five on the clock. Here's Fultz. And another miss by Orlando. Wow, that's one you just kind of assume is going in. Tough luck. And we're through the first half of play here in what's been a good one. Trailblazers out in front. They lead by five. And we'll be back for the second half following the break. Keep it right here on 2K Sports. We've got second half action for you. And if the next couple of quarters are similar to the first, this one could go down to the last possession. You look at Anthony Simons, he's been playing really well. <laughs> There's virtually nothing you can do to stop him. I mean, you can't even contain him. He's been that great. Yeah, and sometimes the strategy in that case, don't let anyone else beat you. You know he's going to get his, so try and keep it to that. Bancaro and Carter Jr. are down low. Harris at the two, with Wagner playing the three. And it's Fultz in at the one. So that's the lineup on the floor for the Magic. And here's Harris outside, rebounded by Nurkic. 
Nurkic has got four rebounds now. Man, Blazers fans have been having a bit of whiplash. Western Conference Finals to the lottery in just three years. BA injuries had a big part to play in that. Shows how fast the NBA landscape can change. Fans are hoping they can get back to what they were just as quickly. The defense there doing whatever they can to protect the rim. Free throw drops for Harris. He's perfect from the line this time. He's living there tonight. A tough guy to guard without fouling. And the bonus, he's going to knock him down. Lillard passes to Graham. Takes the three. Pass to Lillard. Outside Tybal. Lillard against Fultz. From behind the arc. They grab their own miss. Nurkic shot is good. Nurkic is all about physicality on the glass and making his presence felt. Outside Fultz. Grant with a steal. First minute and a half of basketball played here in the third quarter. Here's Lillard. And Fultz pulls it down. You won't see him miss that one too many times. Yes, let's look on the bright side. You got a great look. It's a play that you might want to go back to again. That one off the back iron and out. The Trailblazers have gone 2 of 5 in this third quarter. And Yusuf Nurkic, a solid role player, fits well into any team environment. A great passer and doesn't need touches to contribute. Now here's Lillard. Seven-point game. Biggest lead so far. Still trying to shoot his way out of this funk. But if it doesn't come within the floor of the offense, the whole team suffers. Inside. It's stolen by Nurkic. Lillard against Harris. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Opportunity for a three-point play here. And we saw last year. Nurkic can also act as a mentor with young players, Graham. Yeah, B.A., and that's a great veteran presence from Nurkic. Not a star player by any means, but a player everyone would want on their team. A line change here for Orlando. So Portland going with almost an entire new group here. Eubanks, he's checked in for Nurkic. Watford comes in for Grant. Littles checked in for Theibel. And it's Sharp in for Simons. Looking at players with limitless range, Grant. Damian Lillard right at the top of that list. Oh, B.A. And Lillard, he can just make it look so easy. He gets a lot of his strength on his shot from his legs. On the short list for players you don't mind pulling up from the logo. Portland has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Here's Sharp. That shot off the mark. Oh, great D that time from Isaac. For Orlando, they've gone 0 for 3 to start the second half. Here's Suggs. Pass to Isaac. Puts it up from 12. And too long on the shot. The Trailblazers have gotten just 3 of 8 shots to go in the third quarter. Here's Eubanks. Out to Lillard. Eubanks the screen. From the arc. Portland, no good that time either. Three-pointer, Anthony. The shot comes out, and it's Portland the other way. 41 seconds left in the third quarter of the game. Lillard against Anthony. Pass to Eubanks. Here's Lillard. Eubanks the screen. Let's go with a three. It's hauled in by Isaac. Isaac. 
Anthony against Lillard. Anthony outside. Shot clock at six. There's a screen. Over Lillard. And another miss by Orlando. And as we end the third quarter, a double-digit deficit will make it tough to come back. Trailblazers out in front, up by 10. And when we return, we'll get the fourth quarter rolling here on 2K Sports. All right, let's take a look at our assist of the game presented by State Farm. And I'll tell you what, this was a no-brainer tonight. Take a look at the precision on this feed. Couldn't place it any better. This is why you preach teamwork. Some of the most spectacular plays are the ones where guys are feeding off one another. The fourth quarter has arrived. So good to have you with us. And on the floor for Portland here in the fourth. Grant and Nurkic, they're inside at the four and the five. Sharp out there with Anthony Simons. And it's Reddish in at the three. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Offensively, Bancaro is a difference maker. Not just with the talent, but with his relentless approach. Grant, you watch Bancaro. He's got a rare mix of moves for a big man. Yeah, B.A., the perfect combination of size, strength, and skill. Crosses up defenders well, spin moves, excellent body control, and he uses his body to shield the ball when he's driving through the lane. The first one falls. There aren't many rookies that can carry an offense. Van Carroll has the chops to do it, and he will keep coming right at you. And that's good as he hits both shots. And it's the Blazers with the ball. Pass to Graham. Now Nurkic. From six feet away, it's rebounded by Bancaro. Bancaro's got his fourth rebound in this one. Ooh, a beautiful reverse layup. Bancaro's got four points this quarter. I mean, 6'10", about 250. Bancaro imposing his will inside. Grant right side over Bancaro. Grant shot is off. No one on him. He committed to fading away. Probably could have taken more time with that shot. Wagner, the pass to Fultz. To the paint. Here's Ben Carroll. Carter, high post. Pass to Wagner. We've got about a minute and a half into this fourth quarter. Can't cash it in from the high post. The Magic making a switch here. Harris is checked in. And also a switch here for Portland. Dibble's checked in. Here's Simons. Into the lane. Blocked! That time, Carter's length and vertical paying dividends. He has tremendous potential as a rim protector. Five to shoot, and here's Grant from the arc. Orlando grabs the miss. Carter's got his fourth rebound in this one. Outside Fultz. Pass to Ben Carroll. Over Grant, and Van Carroll with the bucket, and the assist by Fultz. Oh, no holding back from Van Carroll. He wants this team to be able to rely on him in these type of moments. Now here's Steibel. Simons passes to Nurkic. Back to Simons. Looking to end the drought. It's hauled in by the Magic. Carter's got five rebounds tonight. Minute 32 left in the fourth quarter. 
Here's Ben Carroll. The shot won't fall. And it's Portland the other way. Feibel finds Simons. To the inside. Deflects the pass. Wagner with a steal. Pass to Carter. Knocked away. Fultz with it. Out of bounds. It'll be Portland's ball. Cole Anthony. He's checked in for Fultz. Lillard's checked in for Portland. Portland calls timeout. They lead by four. A minute four left in the final quarter. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Allie. During that break, Coach Chauncey Billups had some advice for the team. He told his men in the huddle, this is it. Leave it all out on the floor. Final stretch coming. No easy buckets. I want a full effort out there. Looking to keep his team fired up. Guys? All right. Appreciate it, Allie. A minute four left in the fourth quarter. Nurkic to screen on Anthony. For three, here's Lillard. It's rebounded by Bancaro. Man, at what point do you blame the play calling more than the player? Anthony, left side. Out left to the wing. Here's Bancaro, defended by Lillard. Pass to Carter. Goes up from the block. Out to Anthony. Three-pointer. And once again, off the mark by Orlando. And he commits the intentional foul. And you've got to be in awe of incredible defensive efforts like this. Yeah, just some terrific effort there. And you know the whole team will get an energy boost off a block like that one. And now they decide to foul intentionally. No good as the first free throw misses. We'll see if he can hit the second. This is when Lillard comes alive. The bigger the moment, the more he wants to step up and deliver. And he ends up making the second. And that puts him up five. Orlando calls timeout. They're down by five. There's 25 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter.
There's 25 seconds left to play in the fourth. Anthony against Lillard. Carter, a screen on Lillard. Anthony, the pass to Carter. For three, here's Harris. Rebounded by Nurkic. And so they choose to intentionally foul. He drops the first one, and that increases the lead to six. A player like Nurkic is a good piece for any squad. They can rely on him to take care of business inside on both ends of the floor. And he's unable to get the second one. Orlando calls timeout. They're behind by six. There's six seconds left to play in the fourth. Guys, your thoughts? They need to answer fast. Not only do they need a bucket, they need a three just to give them any chance at all. And here are the Magic now. Harris misses. So it's Portland picking up the win. And they barely squeezed out the win here on the road. And B.A., the visiting team is always under some added pressure. But they made it work and got the win, whatever the margin may have been. All right, now let's check in with Allie LaForce. Allie, what do you have? Dame, a strong defensive effort for you guys tonight. What was the key? Our communication has been much better. Um, our effort has always been there, but now we're doing it smarter. We recognize the play calls. We plan players' tendencies. You know, we just playing much smarter. And um, I think that's half the battle, you know, especially when the effort is there. And we've been on top of things. You know, we came out and took the challenge, and that's where we was able to separate ourselves. That's the experience paying off. Guys, back to you. All right, Allie, thank you. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Grand Hill, Steve Smith and Allie LaForce, this is Brian Anderson. Thanks for watching tonight's game. We'll see you next time.